All right, Shalom. <clears throat> First and foremost, I want to give all praise, glory, and honor unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Double honors unto the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace. Uh, salutations to the Akim who go out throughout the four corners of the earth to push our truth, this truth, the truth. Let me let me get that straight. The truth uh, to the hopeful elect throughout the four corners of the earth. Shalom to you, Akim. This is just another uh, dashboard epistle, as I like to call them. And, uh, you know, I just was reading in the scriptures and I figured I'd bring it out. Um, you know, it was uh, helpful to my spirit today. So, you know, I figured I'd share it with Akim. All right, this is Isaiah 52, starting at 1. Awake, awake, put on thy strength, O Zion. Put on thy beauty, beautiful garments, O Jerusalem, the, uh, the holy city. Right, so that's... Uh, um, Israel and Jerusalem are uh, a people before a place. That's why it says put on your holy garments. And what's, what that's talking about is putting on the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai uh, throughout, through the uh, true doctrine that's been given unto the apostles and elders of the great millstone on down. Right? For henceforth there shall no more come into thee the uncircumcised and unclean. Right? Shake thyself from the dust, arise, and sit down. O Jerusalem, loose thyself from thy from the bands of thy neck, O captive daughter of Zion. Right, so that's what we're doing now. Right, we're still physically in bondage, but we are uh, uh, spiritually and mentally breaking down these uh, barriers. Right, that the so-called white man Esau has set up. And 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 just for for uh, reference sake, you so-called uh, Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, and Seminole Indians. Um, are the chosen people of the most high power, right? You are the 12 tribes of the nation of Israel. And those uh, so-called names I just gave you are your, uh, your your slave names, slave commodity names, right? So this is talking to you. And Esau, the so-called white man, Edom, according to the Bible, right, is your enemy, right? And it's talking about loose thyself from thy bands of thy neck, O captive daughters of Zion, right? It's time to wake up, right? Thus forth saith Yahweh, ye have sold yourselves for naught, and ye have ye shall be redeemed without money. Right? So we we have sold ourselves, right? We we sold out, you know, as a nation. Now you have those that uh uh six uh I believe it's seven thousand that have not bowed their knee to Baal, right? And you have the remnant of Israel that won't, right? But for the most part, our people have bought unto idols. Right, and the, the way we're going to be redeemed without money is Yahweh Shai, the son of Yahweh, is going to come back in uh, what the world calls uh, UFOs, which are the chariots of the Most High, according to the Bible, to redeem and save his elect. <clears throat> Not everybody. For this say Yahweh power, my people went down aforetime into Egypt to sojourn there, and the Assyrian. Assyrian oppressed them without a, without cause, right? Because we've always been uh, slaves. That's why the scriptures say, "Are thee a natural born slave?" You know, home born slave. Is that is that just your? Is that what you do? Like you like being a slave? Or are you gonna wake up? Um, but yeah, so this is kind of getting into that. Um, so like you. Now therefore, what have I here? Saith saith Yahweh, that my people is taken away for not. They that rule over them make them to howl, saith Yahweh, and my name continually every day is blaspheme, right? And this so-called white man causeth us to howl, right? Are we not getting shot in the streets, you know, by police daily? And you, you idiots don't realize that that's the reason that the so-called white man put up the police in the first place. It goes back to the slave, uh, slave revolts. And the, uh, so they needed somebody to watch the slaves. And that's the reason why they chose the Irish and the Scottish, because even though they are, a lot of them are Jakes, a lot of them are Israel, they could actually handle, you know, getting into it with uh, with, with Jake. Those would be your confusion of faces, uh, Jakes, right? That's why they have this, the bagpipe ceremonies and all that Scottish influence and all that, right? That goes back to uh, the Scottish and Irish. And that's a whole nother lesson. Um, but they, uh, they cause us to howl, man. The 
the the saints man we sigh and cry daily for the abominations that are done in this place number one and number two we're in we're in bondage like it may not be you may not be getting hung up on a on a rope in front of everybody in the city but they still killing you in front of everybody right how beautiful upon the mountains of uh, verse 7 how beautiful upon the mountains are the feet of him that bringeth good tidings and that publish peace and bring good tidings of good that publisheth salvation that saith unto zion all right this is only for israel saith unto zion thy power reigneth right yahweh reigneth thy watchmen shall lift up thy voice lift up the voice that's what we do when we go out in the highways and byways week in week out in season out of season that's what we be doing with the voice together shall they sing for they shall see eye to eye when yahweh shall bring again zion right we're gonna be all on one accord right with with the most high power yahweh by shim shai you know under the elect you know from the apostles on down we're gonna be in, in one one song man one one accord we all gonna have the beautiful we're all learning right now you know we're all under the same thing right now but even more so when we get that new uh that new covenant right and he puts that the, the covenant in our inward parts break forth into joy sing together ye waste places of jerusalem for yahweh hath confounded his people he hath redeemed uh jerusalem right and this is going to happen this is a prophecy that will be done the lord hath made bare his holy arm in the eyes of all the nations and all the ends of the earth shall see the salvation of our power right because uh those chariots man they, the, especially the the father chariot that's going to be that's going to be enormous right and and all these nations are going to witness our salvation lord willing we are part of that number depart ye depart depart ye depart ye go ye out from thence touch no unclean thing go out into the midst of her be ye clean that bear the vessels of yahweh right and that's what we're doing man we're cleaning ourselves up by spiritually uh um you know washing the blood off of our hands right and uh you know and and and, and curing ourselves from this wickedness through uh through this word through the the through the scriptures through the holy bible right for ye shall not go without without haste nor go by flight for yahweh will go before you and the power of israel will be your reward behold my servant shall deal prudent prudently he shall be exalted and extolled and be very high this is talking about yahweh shai and many were astonished, 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 right? Astonished at thee. His visage was so marred, more than any man, and his form more than any, more than the sons of men, right? Because they they tore him up. You know what I'm saying? They they beat Yahweh Shai, uh, wor you know, worse than they beat Emmett Till, right? And if you ever look up pictures of Emmett Till, it's, he wasn't even recognizable. So shall he sprinkle many nations. The king shall shut their mouths at him. Right? He's about to he's about to rain judgment on these nations. He's gonna put them in their place. And they, they every every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Yahweh Shai is Lord and that Yahweh Yahweh is, is the all powerful creator, right? For um for that which had not been told them shall they see. And that which they had not heard shall they consider, right? So those that have their eyes closed and their ear and their ears closed, they're gonna understand and they're gonna see, you know, that this is real. And even you know, even if they've heard it now and don't believe, that they gonna believe in that day, guaranteed, right? Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai has has put that forth. So uh, with that, I'm gonna wrap it up. That was a beautiful, uh, you know. Um, beautiful uh chapter uh, the water for sharing with me you know sitting here listening to me and uh you know lord willing it's edifying unto the elect and uh, until next time the next dashboard epistle shalom